Welcome everybody to the Diamond Life After Party. It's our jam session. Hopefully you just watched one of the most epic finals that just went down. This is our 20 minute jam session where all of our skaters hit the course at the same time for the shot at five Gs and some proper after party, after party uh, event coverage. Instead of popping bottles, we're popping ollies right now? Is that what you're trying to say? We're popping ollies, then we're popping bottles. Okay, okay. <laughs> the, winner, the winner of the after party will get served up right at the actual official Street League after party, the Diamond Life after party, fueled by Monster Energy, going down after the event. So as you see, 19 minutes and counting. It's a 20 minute jam session. We got our judges out there. These guys still have 20 minutes of skateboarding left in them after all this amazing skateboarding that's gone on all weekend. Oh man, just shut it down already. Shane O'Neal. Shane O'Neal, nollie flip crooked grind, nollie flip out. I think, uh, I think we're good. <laughs> I think we're good at the, at the 19 minute mark, first minute in. So you are watching the Diamond Life After Party here on StreetLeague.com. And Felix, I know we want to get into these tricks, but I, I just got to catch my breath after that impact section. From yeah. The final earlier, yeah. I'm not going to lie. Shane could have used that move in the contest. <laughs> so look Malto's at, back. Malto board complete. Again, if you're just tuning in, you don't know what happened. Malto's board completely falling apart on his very first flow attempt. I mean, maybe one too many front crooks. He grinded his bolt right off. He didn't even get to Ollie before the nut fell off and the rest of his board fell apart. It was crazy. It kind of looked like that intro in the girl video. It did. When Mark Johnson's That's trucks right. and everything fell off. That uh -huh. was crazy. Nice Tommy. Now Tommy Sandoval frontside flipped that gap already. I'm not going to lie, the lion likes to fly. Whoop. You know, what I love about this session, Felix, is this, this is the ultimate jam session. Where else are you going to see all of your favorite pros out on the course at the exact same time? Absolutely putting it down. This is like if you showed up to some strange downtown that nobody was present and then all these perfect spots were there. Is this, is this anything like Sean Malto's training facility about three days ago? A couple of the obstacles are similar and definitely some familiar faces out there. It was a really good crew, man. We even had an international playing field. Bastion joined the locals. Chris Cole is still out there having fun. He just did a 50-50 through the King Hubba and back foot flipped it out. <laughs> so you're checking out the Diamond Life after party. I mean, really, if Street League happens anywhere near your hemisphere, you just have to come out for it. Because you really get to interact with everybody. You get to see everything the cameras can catch. And, like, everybody in the league is just really cool, man. I see Nikki Diamond over there in attendance. Diamond was always present, but now being a sponsor, you know Nick's going to be at every event with the whole crew. So, again, the winner of today's Diamond Life After Party walks away with uh, five Gs and bottled up at the club. Probably gets a proper seat at the booth at the club tonight. Seat at the booth? They get their own booth. Let's be real. <laughs> well, you know, out here the bottles are a little cheaper, so 5000 goes a long way in KC. Look at Nigel Houston getting in on the party. Nigel's never done. If he was ever done, he would never be that good. Nigel, 100 grand richer today after his third consecutive street league win. Man. I don't know how that kid doesn't have a bodyguard. Oh, that's the one he left behind. He actually stepped off that one. The one undone trick for the whole weekend for him. He made every single other trick he tried all weekend. You know, we've had a cast of different characters win this thing in past years. Tom Asta, Shogware. Yeah, I believe I believe um, Shane has one too. Yeah, Shane. Any dark horses out here today that uh, you think might win this thing? I mean, Ishad off camera just did a backside 360 ollie kickflip over the grass feature in the middle. So maybe, maybe Shad. I see Paul still out there, switch flip back lift. It's nice to see he still has a little energy after that amazing finish. You 
Malto gets revenge on that front crook. Talk about of all tricks to have that accident on. Malto misses a front crook. <laughs> I mean, everybody's in Kansas human. City. In Kansas City, in a Kansas City jersey. Everything. I mean, anything's possible. Malta's become the jersey guy. He wore a Barcelona jersey, I think, pandering True. to the Spanish crowd when we were there a couple of weeks ago. I mean, that's one of the benefits of riding for Nike. Yeah. You know, you get to rock a jersey. Got all these team uh, jersey deals. Yeah, you can stay extra sporty on your board. And oh, man, Nigel almost had a major accident. <laughs> Closing in on the 14-minute mark here for the Diamond Life after party. We're gonna see you at the after party, after party though, right, Pete? Oh yeah, and then after the party is a hotel lobby. And then, and after, then that? after the lobby is room Dan Abadi. <laughs> Dan Abadi out here filming somewhere. Oh yeah, you can check out them clips on streetleague.com. Watching live coverage of the Diamond Life after party. Diamond hardware heavy hitters since 1998. Everybody at home, let me know what you think should be winning at one Felix, O-N-E-F-E-L-I-X. I'm gonna call out some of you guys right now from my Twitter. Nigel just crooked grinded off camera, through the double kick and tried to nollie flip out. If he does that, I'm gonna run outside and tackle him. This guy's just out of control. Hey, I want to thank, uh, who is this right here? Gonzalo, thank you for saying I'm the best commentator. You're, you I mean, too kind, too kind. <laughs> okay, no more about me. How about you, Brandon? It's the truth, man. You are the voice. Uh, Matt Miller coming in on the hub. Uh, no. No. Tommy Sandoval. Charging. Someone's like, I heard you sneak a go heat in there. Hell yeah, I'm sneaking a go heat in there. Sneak another one in right now. Chris Bradford liked the Ninja. That's an old one. That's, That's like old two one. seasons. I think that was the first there. season. Yeah, that one got dusty. We just brought it back because there was just so many. <laughs> hey, nines you had today. to. You had to. This kid's out of control, averaging a nine the whole day. Manny Slays All will be joining us. Don't worry, he's almost there, man. He won two street leagues, he got himself a bronze. He'll be in Germany, he'll be in LA, and maybe even at the finals in New Jersey. Don't worry about it, guys. Manny Slays All is coming for you. Manny Santiago, our top-ranked select series skater. Okay, Benji said he, he's going for Shane O'Neill and Chris Cole. We got another Shane O'Neill here. Shane O'Neill, they're calling out the moves. We got Dan Paul and Petey Oneism. Got a lot of Shane fans online right now on my Twitter. Well, Shane started things off properly. Okay, showdown. Paul Nolly flip crook, Nolly late front foot flip. I mean, I think I'm gonna have to just shut my Twitter off right now. Oh, Alex Van Zwietering says someone should do something creative like a firecracker. True, if we had the lizard in the street league, we'd see plenty of firecrackers. Shane already won, that's what Nicholas Drummond says, but did you see Paul right now, though? Ammon Bodie, we got a vote for Poundy Shot. I know Jim's out there voting for your shot as well. I always feel like every time we get to one of these, it's a shots to lose. We got another Shane from Glenn Harpin. Glenn, Shane? I feel that pick, I feel Yo, that Shane's pick, Glenn. Yo, Shane's big on the internet. But did you guys see Paul's nollie flip crook, nollie late flip? I caught the end of it. I don't know if that one made the camera. Well, somebody was following him though. Let's get that fire wire connected and let's get it on tape. Chris Cole coming in. Chris Cole. Leonidas from 300. What's that actor's name? Gerard Butler. Gerard Butler skate stunt double. I'll tell you, if Chris Cole would have won tonight, that shirt would have been ripped off. Yep. It's a guarantee. He said he was gonna hulk his shirt. Chris Cole needs it with a 50-50 late flip out. True, Jesse, that was a tough one right there. I like Jesse, man. Jesse could be out here commentating. They're with all us. playing with us. I like that. I got you, Jesse. I just said that. You don't got to hit me twice. Oh, Matt Miller with the switch trade flip over that hubba. That could be a contender. That's a trick for him. 
All right, we are just about halfway done here through the Diamond Life oh, after party. Ishad almost grinded up the double king perfectly right now. Paul still dropping some late action. Nolly the little double set late front front flip. Flip front front flip flip flip. Oh. Hey, hey, Tori, where are you at? We got some votes for you to get back on the course from Ben Talbert. Street League pumped to have Diamond as a brand new partner for the 2013 season. Yo, Sebastian Ski, what's up to you too, buddy? Paul, switch back tail. Switch backside flip out. Imagine going skateboarding in Paul's shoes. Paul's shoes should come with all his tricks in them. That'd be, that'd be the most expensive pair of shoes in the world. Or at least to be able to skate switch that well. While I was talking crap, Matt Miller's stuck in a switch tray over the hub. Amazing. Again, if you're just joining us here on StreetLeague.com for the Diamond Life after party, in case you missed it, Nigel Houston winning the third straight stop of the 2013 season here in KC. I just got a shout out from Mickey Papa, who's definitely a contender for a future Street League. He's saying his boy Paul Rodriguez has got this. What up, Mickey? Here's Tommy Sandoval. He's been going. He's been going for this. Yeah! The Flying Lion! Could that be a new nickname? The Flying Lion? Things like that happen by accident. Nobody is better at nicknames <laughs> than Felix Aguero. I've been known to tag some that stuck for plenty of years. <laughs> Daniel Luna giving a shout out to Chris Cole. He's got an amazing style. I agree with you, man. My man has a deep bag of tricks, too. Old school, new school. Not created yet, school. Yo, let's make sure we get this trending. Hashtag Diamond Life After Party. Hey, Benji just gave us a shout out. He said we're the funniest commentators right now. Should we do a little something at the, at the Laugh Factory one day, maybe? They'll just throw shoes at us. Open mic night. Oh, man, that's scary. I like hiding behind the internet and behind, like, monitors and stuff. Shane O'Neill's got more. Nolly flip crook. Step off, step on. Nolly flip 180 out. Eric Clark, same P rod. You know who I'm not seeing in this who usually skates it pretty well is Tom Asta. Rafael's watching the TV closer than I am. He's saying Chris Cole with the Nolly 360 hard flip. I missed that one. I missed it too. He shot going for a backside 5 0 down the double kink. I lost it behind all the blonde hair of the monster girls walking in front of me. Jeez. Blonde number one or blonde number two? Blonde ambition tour, minus one. <laughs> Jordy, let's go. Where are we going? The Flying Lion locked it down. Okay, Pound Diamond Life. Another shout there out to the go. party. There you go. Paul's got more, though. Pound Diamond Life after party. Oh, the Africans are watching right now. Yo, shout out to Cape Town. Jason Osborne, I see you, buddy. Hey, South Africa, where it is. Hopefully, I'll see you again this year at that other comp. We're all in the same gang. It's a skate gang. We've got about six minutes, 25 seconds left in the Diamond Life after party. It's a best trick jam session. Someone's going to walk away with five Gs. Hey, if someone's listening to us online, it's going to be at Mosaic tonight for that Diamond after after party. Give me a shout out. I'm going to call you out. KC has been very, very good to Street League. And does anybody in KC know where that vegetarian barbecue is at? I'm looking for that fake no, set of ribs. That ain't real. <laughs> That's not a real thing. We need a veggie grill out here with some barbecue. All right, V, we got a little bit more than five minutes to play with. Who's, who's your guy? Man, let me see. I'm saying P-Rod, Nolly Flip Crook, Nolly Late Flip Out wasn't on tape. I don't know if that could still win. You know, vote from the people. On tape, Shane, Nolly Flip Crook, Nolly yeah. Flip Out the Hubba. That is pretty, pretty, should I use my stereotypical Go. adjective? Go ahead. Critical. I love how much heat I get for using the word critical. Can you guys just send me a bunch of other? Well, actually, I got thesaurus.com. I'll look up a couple other ones in tens. Um, I'm glad you finally got that app, by the way. I don't know what else, but I, I like critical. How about surgical? Tell Costin to get in there. Adam Earl said, Costin, get in there. Costin's Stop brewing. Costin's too busy throwing t-shirts out to the crowd. I think Costin's shopping for a new all-over print. 
Pirot has it unlocked. That's what Morgan said. We're just under five minutes. Oh, oh Biggin says he's going to be there getting it popping. All right, Biggin, see you there. Find us. Find us, Biggins. I'll be by the, the, the booth with all the little Twizzler little lights, the little, what do you call those things? The sparklers. Sparklers, those things. Wearing sunglasses. Felix, always known to rock the shades in the no club. No shades oh, in the on. club. No shades in the club. I've only done That's that once rule. or twice. <laughs> once or twice, just a clown. Oh, I got another shout out from Africa. What time is it in Africa right now? I love it that you guys are watching this. And it was an African shout out for Ishad from Andrew Nero. Rod. Oh, we got a shout out to Holland. We got Holland on deck right here. Jesse underscore E O one seven two. No, I love that Dutch skate scene. It must be hard to skate in wooden shoes. <laughs> but I have put on some stiff shoes before. I can feel your pain, guys. Now I just got more tricks. Frontside nose drying, 20 feet long, and Nolly and would heel flip out. Like, come on, kid. Costa needs to get some of this action. All right, pretty Flacco, pause. Like, not, Nigel got 100K, and he's out here throwing his body around to get another five. He must have some high bills. <laughs> I mean, he's got a new whip. He's going to put Monster out of uh, out of business with the matches. He's got a new whip. What, do you get a spaceship? Is that what it, it is? He's got like a it. spaceship. He goes into the future, and he brings back a couple tricks. You're cheating, Nigel, if you got a time machine. Matt Miller trying to go big. Liam says, go Shane O'Neill, pound CMP crew. Oh, we got Frankie. You know Frankie. Everybody knows Frankie. Gives us a shout out. Frankie, Frankie Washburn. Frankie Washburn. Keeping it real, man. Number one fan, Frankie Washburn. You just got yourself a shout out. Rob Deardek for life. Frankie Washburn. Diamond Life after party. Less than three minutes to go, fans. Tweet at one Felix. Who's got this thing on lockdown? Yo, ja Josh Gagnon says, holy the flying lion. <laughs> I like the flying lion. You got that trending now. I think he should. Oh, Shane. It's Shane. Big Spin from Blunt. Big Spin. I'm sorry. It's Shane. I mean, Big Spin from Blunt. Shove. Holy tongue twisters. Shane's my pick, man. Man, I need a glass of water. I'm not going to talk till next week. I, I ran out of words. What a bummer for us all. <laughs> Jeff Lee saying, pound diamond after party at p 84 if he makes the front foot late flip on the hubba from Hong Kong. Wow. I agree with you, buddy. Hong Kong's in here. We got Holland in here. We got Africa in here. This is really happening right now. Get that ball. Hold on, I got some text messages too. I oh, know we got an email. Oh, there's smoke coming out of my iPhone. What do I do now? Two minutes. Minus two minutes. Until we crown our winner for the Diamond Life After Party. Yo, I got to give a quick shout out to Mofi too for keeping me powered up. Because obviously I couldn't keep doing this if it wasn't for Mofi. Thank you, buds. Diamond, the hardware heavyweights. Oh, we got 1998. Ben Talbert from UK Manchester. Shout out to you, Ben, but who are you voting for, though? That's what I want to I'm know. down with the shout outs, but I need to vote. It's about what's going on in here. And this P Rod, man, he's going for it. It's so amazing that the world. Oh, Paul Rodriguez! Nolly late foot flip down the hubba. No respect for ankles. You know how much stuff could have gone wrong right there? Remember when I said Shane was the pick? Hey, you know Me what? Me neither. It's P Rod. You know what it's shoes? You know what shoes I got on? Felix, I don't know how you I, got these P Rods. I nuts. got them from Paul's house. Where else am I gonna get them from? Those well, aren't even available I'm in shooting story. Shooting a photo of my feet right now, and I'm gonna post them online. And if you guys are voting for Paul, I want these shoes retweeted right now. Oh man, that was incredible. I'm gonna try every trick that Paul did in these shoes, and if they don't work, I'm taking them back. Tommy Gods, no! The flying lion, man. Yo, so we are into the final 30 seconds of the Diamond Life after party. Let us know who walks away winner. This is so wild. You guys obviously got Felix busy, man. He stopped watching. I'm talking, he I'm stopped talking watching the event. I'm He's not talking judging to you. I'm not judging. I'm hanging out with my people right here. I mean, it's called social network Six, for a reason, right? Five, We're social. Four, 
three. I mean, two, Paul, Paul shut one. it down. Let's be real. And time is up. The Diamond Life after party. Is it a Paul and Shane Rochambeau right now? Is that what we're going to do? How are we deciding this? Where are the judges at? So let's go down to the floor to find out who walks away with the five Gs and the bottle from the club where the official after party will be going down. We're looking down here, P-Rock. Pounds, Ashad, Niger there. All your favorites down there on the course, Malto, of course. I don't know, Felix. Oh wow, we just got, we got, we got Egypt watching this. Shout out Mohammed from Egypt. Shout out Tyler from the UK. So let's look back, Felix, at some of the highlights. Nolly late front foot flip. Signature Paul move over the little double set. Nolly crooked grind. Super slow. Smooth, smooth. Nolly late front foot flip. Point. Come on, man. Too much control for one human being to have over a skateboard. So you're saying those shoes do that? I don't know. I got them on. I'm taking them to the streets right after this. Hey, Paul, if, if these shoes don't have right those numbers. tricks, I want the ones you're wearing. Because those did, did some work today. So we're still, uh, I think we're waiting on who's going to win this thing. Yo, Darren, thank you for watching. And my man, Anthony, who was hanging with me at Escapist the other day, one of the locals here, everybody in KC is so friendly and makes you feel right at home. It's like a place you'd want to just, like, skate, vacate, and just chill and, like, you know, get away from it all in the big city. Well, let's take a look at a highlight from Shane O'Neill, who was my pick I mean, to win. Shane Nolly was my pick to win. Nolly in. Nolly flip out. I mean, he flipped in and he flipped out. Honestly, Shane could be the guy. Shane could be the guy because that... And a fakey. Like, Shane, I think this could be Shane's. Well, Nostradamus, I think. I mean, damn, man. I think he might be Yo, I'll rushing. tell you one thing. Nike gets pretty technical out here, not just on the shoes, but in the skateboarding field. Oh. Right, Let's go down the course. Right Is that Jake Dubs right there? there? Who do you got with you? I'm still observing the last 20 minutes of bonus skateboarding that we all got, insane skateboarding. Kansas City, what do you think of that? What do you think of the last 20 minutes of extra Hi. skateboarding you yeah. up? Everybody that at home, That is scream. crazy. All right, so I have Jerani here from Diamond Supply Co. And he's going to break down what just happened and who took it all away. Basically, Shane O'Neill just won the prize. Basically, you're, you're winning five grand. Boom! You got a nice bottle of Clico <laughs> okay. champagne for this evening. <laughs> okay. We're having a big after party. <laughs> thank you so much for coming out. I want to thank Street League. <laughs> <laughs> hey, yo, Shane, let me get a yes. sip, buddy. Congrats. Shane. Amazing, man. <laughs> I got to see where Shane's heading after this. So does Shane get to Thank take that home, so or does that go back to the club? The Diamond Life after party winner, Shane O'Neill, 5Gs. Are you allowed Bottled to bring up. that much fluid in an airplane? I don't think you can unless it's gasoline, and they own it. Bottled up. This, Nolly flip this crooked grind. This had to be grind. the trick that did it. Quick twinkle toe, Nolly flip out at the end. Shane O'Neill. Well, thanks to all the fans from watching for all over the world. Stay tuned. StreetLeague.com.